Hi everyone and welcome to WebDev Tutorials. In this video you will learn how to make this navigation bar which comes from the right side. So we're going to use a bit of HTML, CSS and the JavaScript. So it has the opening and the closing icon. Okay, let's go to our index code. So let's create, we're gonna create first nav so just type nav and with it within this nav we create id of navigation and within that we create unordered list and within here we create list so here's going to be the links to our pages so just put a link here Just name them. Just copy this line and just paste it. I'm going to paste it five times because I'm creating five pages. Just rename them. Next, next is going to be the image, so the closing and the opening image. So let's just include just next to here, mg. So that's going to be the opening image. And we need some line for JavaScript later on we're going to use. Which is this one. So we're going to create the open function and then close function. That will be for the end and then the ID of menu icon. And let's do just the same thing for the closing one. Just include the image. Spelling here. Okay, just give ID as well. Close icon and just save it. Okay, so we have our links here and the icons. So now let's go to your style. So first thing we're going to start the ID, which we gave navigation. To so get width of 200 fix 50 pixels. Height 150 VH. Position will be fixed. Give right minus 250. Top zero. Change background color. and the transition 4.3 seconds so it will be smooth transition when it comes from the right side just save okay so we got them here and the next thing will be nav ul li let's remove the list tile that bullets and we give margin of 
50 pixel by 20 pixels. Next one is links. We remove text decoration so there is no underline. And we give color of white. And then the menu icon. So this is the opening menu icon. Give position same, fixed. Change the width to 45 pixels. Give right 60 pixels. Top 35 pixels. to and the cursor pointer so I just copy the same and this one will be for the close icon, close icon. And we just add another thing display none because later on we change this one to display in line with JavaScript Refresh. Okay, so now it's not working because we need JavaScript. Let's go back to our code. So now just go at the end, just create a script, just put the script tags here. And inside here we create so variable of navigation document get element by its id navigation and then navigation style right minus 250 pixels okay so now we need to make the function for the opening one. so function open function as we named before and we target now to get element by its id Navigation style right equals zero. Next is again document get element by ID menu icon, so the opening one. display none so we want to hide it when we click and then the closing icons style display They want it to show. Let's just save. See, now it's working, but now we need the closing one. So now it's okay. Let's just refresh again. And when we click, it opens, it slides up, and now we need to close. So we need to create the closing function. So let's make it easy. We copy this one just paste and we just rename here we put close function and we change elements here it goes to minus 250 pixels so the menu icon now it will have to come from hidden and the close one have to hide so we could not okay, save it 
Let's go back. Refresh. Here we go. It works. Pretty simple. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to subscribe and uh, like this video if you find it helpful. Thank you and see you next video. Bye.